For many college students, their wardrobe consists of plenty of t-shirts, but there's one kind of shirt you won't be able to sport, anything with Johnny Manziel's name or likeness. A person caught selling them could face legal troubles. And students like Daniel Danny says it serves them right. I think that, uh, that Johnny Manziel is in the right uh, to take legal action because um, he's got to protect himself and uh, him and his family trademarked his name for a reason. Even merchandisers like Aguilan Outfitters agrees. It's important for him, for his future, that he protects that trademark. The t-shirt in question looks like this. Notice it's in Spanish. That change came after a cease and desist letter from Manziel's lawyer. T-shirt companies like Aggieland Outfitters take precaution when it comes to respecting trademarks. However, independent t-shirt sellers may not understand the consequences of trademark infringement. Anything that uses his likeness. Uh, and so we won't even print anything that has Johnny on it uh, because, you know, it could be construed as his likeness. A Texas A&M spokesman says the sale of the t-shirt does not hurt his eligibility. Protecting that is top priority for Aguilan Outfitters when designing up new shirts. You know, we would never want to do anything that would jeopardize our relationship with Texas A&M or anything that would, you know, put us in a, a, a bad situation with someone like Johnny Manziel. For those thinking, why is this a big deal? If Manziel doesn't protect his trademark now, he could face losing it, therefore not being able to profit from an after-college ball. Aggies stand behind his choice to file a lawsuit and don't believe it's a money-driven decision. I think if he doesn't go after the guy right now, then that just opens a door for other people to keep cashing in and making money off of Johnny football. Monica Castro, KAGS HD News.